Good morning, YouTube, and welcome to Cooking Production. Well, as you see, today I have my first guest speaker, Donovan Stewart. He is the very first guest speaker on my show. Um, yeah, the camera kind of looks to the side, but if you can't see me, then I'm sorry you should be hear me. But yeah, um, today we're going to be talking about, I don't know what we're going to be talking about. We just don't talk off the side of our heads, but um, let's see, foster care. Let's, let's pick that topic today. Foster care because you care. I don't know, that was random. So, Donovan's gonna tell us a little bit about I am a foster child myself, but you know, coming from me, you know, it's just like, okay, I talk all the times and I give y'all my point of view. It's boring. <laughs> I give y'all my point of views on everything. So, I decided to have somebody else on the show. So, Donovan's gonna give you his point of view, his positive point of view on foster care, okay? Nothing negative. And trust me, wait, just to throw in there, or he'll try. <laughs> just throw in there, um, foster care, you know, how you see it on TV where people don't get fed and beaten and all this kind of stuff is not like that. It is not like that, okay? Children do get fed, okay? We get fed three meals a day. Beyond outings, it's not that we have a glamorous life. They don't give us money like some of you think, like, oh, you have foster care, so you must be rich. It's not like that. He's not doing that. Yes. I am broke. <laughs> but no, it's not like that. But so he's going to give you his point of view. I give you my point of view later on. So, you want to take it out there? Okay. Well, should I start with out of the womb or should I go to when I came here? Let's start with when you came here. I only got 10 <laughs> minutes to be here. <laughs> okay, well, when I came here, honestly, my life was a little screwy. And when I came here, it was to say a little, a little worse. But when you get to foster care, you get used to it. First, you get the two nice people to where you just want to say, you know, leave me alone. Then you get the people that you really wish they were the nice people that you had before. And then you have the people that are like your shadow. They just want to be around you all the time and see what you're doing. Um, <laughs> but anyway, like I was saying, um, as you see, I'm looking at orange sheets for the first time. Because they didn't have tea here, because you know, this is not my house, this is the, um, the playroom, and they didn't have tea, so I can't drink tea today, but I'm drinking orange juice, so this is, um, you know, pay attention, because it's going to be on y'all quiz. Um, yeah. <laughs> quiz? Yes, I'm going to give them a quiz on the things that I like to see, how much my fans know me, what do I drink you on my shows, what, when did I have my first guest, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Your host doesn't know it's summer vacation and you're not supposed to take a quiz, but I'll see if I can talk about it, you'll we'll see. By the time you take the quiz, school is start, trust me. <laughs> It'll be next year January. Prepare for it. So, I don't know how much video we have to get up now, but I would guess about three, four, five minutes, because you know we're going to talk for a while. But foster care, basically, is not, it's the same as your house, except for our parents are not our biological parents, if you can say it like that. And the people that you stay with aren't your biological siblings. I stay in the house with six boys, but now we're going to three, actually four. Because two left, no. And with a hand up, we got a dog named Hannah. She right there. I wish I could show it to y'all, but I don't feel like getting up and getting the camera and turning around and all the time. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, but you know, when you talk about the care, you must expect not the bad, but the good to. You no, know, it has its ups and downs. We have a house right there. Z. She's a good person, and some, you know, sometimes you can clash with people, and sometimes I might not have the same understanding, which I uh, so, um, prepared to happen a lot. And down in most often they prepare to happen. Because, you know, they have two different personalities. He thinks his glass is half empty. He asked me, it's half empty too. We're both on that side of the wall. Yeah, this is a raggedy glass. Yeah, you know, saw all the keys and stuff. But yeah, so that's basically it about foster care. We ain't really touch all the bases with foster care. I'll probably touch all the bases later. But you know, I just want to have my first guest star speaker, Donovan Stewart, and because he begged me to be on the show, like really, like people. Yeah, it's so popular, you can tell. Yeah, with my two subscribers, it's very popular. Yeah, like really popular. But you know, it'll be popular sooner or later. You know, to my, I'm gonna post it on, you know, everybody's stuff. 
So I believe that's all the time we have for today. Maybe you'll see me again. Maybe. Um, so that's all the time we have for today. See you later. Deuces. This is Donovan Stewart taking over for Clifton Productions. This is what he would like to call a behind the scenes look at what's to come. Clifton is making a video on anger, anger something, you know, I'm not really good with words right now. But he's making a video on anger something and he's thinking about putting in a lot more people like me. Well, you know, you can't have somebody like me, but we'll try to get close enough. And I think I'll give you a behind the scenes history on me, since this is all about me right now. So basically, we were talking last time about foster care. This is a true story. I am in the foster care system. I came here, I can't give you the real dates, but I'd say seven months ago, into a house with a nice person, and I was really enjoying it too much. You know, I was thinking I can do whatever I want to do here. And then they moved me to a house with the strictest person in the universe. I don't know how to explain it, but I'd say, you know. I could get sued if I mention names and all this. So moving on, I get to this house. I find some new people, some friends, some very annoying people. And I found Clifton, the director of the, this great series. That was me clapping, just to let you know. It was me. You can have a guess. <laughs> and I'm hoping to be here soon. I'm hoping to do some more videos, introduce some new characters, not take over the show. After all, this is Clifton's productions. And Clifton, I think this is a wrap. Okay. Well, basically, this was my show. I had my first guest speaker, and it was awesome. It went better than I actually expected it to go. You know, I thought it would be, like, you know, crazy. But it didn't go crazy. But um, I must present this news now, since I never did. Um, I'm working on a movie. Yes, a movie. A 10-minute movie, you know. It's about, like, two hours, because YouTube doing this new 10-minute thing. I keep saying, I say that in every video, don't I? But anyway, so, it's going to be a 10-minute movie. I don't know what it's going to be about yet. Well, actually, I do. I just want to keep it to a surprise to y'all. So it's going to be a 10-minute movie. And it's going to be something like Jackass, just to give y'all you know, a hint of what it's going to be about. And sadly, so, I'm not going to be in this video, most likely. Yes, we'll he see. is. He's going to be the main character. So I will see y'all later. You no, know, my motto, keep it R-E-A-L. Keep it real. It's, it's, it's the folk that make you jump Sexy honey shake they hump Got them dummies spending money Just to get up in your junk Why you drink